If I look tired, it's because I am. Ooh, that was very tricky of you, Target. If you're trying to start a diaper stockpile, keep watching. Hey, welcome, I'm Ray. I am a mom of three under four years old. I have a daughter who is just shy of four years old. I have a son who just turned 18 months and I have a daughter who is two months old today. So I definitely do have a need for diapers. <sighs> And if you've watched some of my videos before, you know that I've recently started emergency prepping. If you're interested in knowing why, I do have that video linked down below for you, so you can go ahead and watch that after this one. The reason I'm not really afraid of stockpiling diapers when there's a good deal is because they don't expire. I do have multiple children, so there is a good chance that if one child doesn't get through all of the diapers I have stockpiled, my newborn will. Worst case scenario, I can donate them to someone who needs them if all of my children end up not needing these diapers. If you're like me and you have a need for diapers and you're looking to either start a diaper stockpile or just have a few extra on hand in case you need them, I'm hoping that this video is very helpful for you. There was a good deal at Target today, so I did go with my newborn and we got some diapers. So if you didn't know, about once every month, Target runs a deal where if you spend $100 on diaper supplies, so that's diapers and wipes, you get a $20 gift card to Target, which itself is a pretty good deal. I like to try and only buy diapers during that time, unless there's a good deal at another store, of course, or I find a deal online, which is pretty rare. I do like to save my money to be able to spend $100 at a time at Target. Now, I don't actually spend $100 because if you've ever coupon before you know that buying things when it's a sale is good but it's really not that great. What you want to do is you want to stack a sale on top of manufacturer coupons to be able to save the most money possible and that's what I did today. I went on my app, I looked through the manufacturer coupons that were available on Target Circle. If you don't have Target Circle you definitely need to download the app and enroll in that. It's literally just free coupons. You're missing out if you're not using it. The other thing I really do recommend you use in the Target app if you haven't already is sign up for a Target debit card. I shied away from this for a long time because I, I thought that the savings option was a credit card where they pulled your credit and it worked like a regular credit card where you were given a line of credit. They do have a Target credit card that has additional benefits but what I signed up for and what I think would benefit everyone would be if they signed up for a Target debit card. They give you a physical card but honestly you can just use the virtual one in the app. I actually don't carry the physical one with me. It pulls directly from your bank account two to three days after you spend it so it's not immediate instant like a regular debit card is but it does pull directly from your account the benefit of it is you get five percent back on every purchase you use with that debit card when you're spending around a hundred dollars that's five dollars in savings it's worth it it's basically for me saving me the sales tax which is great now another thing about couponing is you can actually accidentally spend more money than you intended to and not save anything if you don't read the fine print and make sure that you're following following all the rules of the sales and the rules of the coupons. And when I was going through my cart at the end here, I had chose to pick up. I don't normally shop in the store and peruse around because three kids, motherhood. So I typically use the drive up and I had them in my cart for drive up pickup. I was noticing that the manufacturer coupons weren't adding and I was like, that's weird. I have them clipped. Why is this happening? This has never happened before. So after going back and reading the fine print of the manufacturer coupons, it turns out that Target would only let you use those manufacturer coupons if you bought them in store. So you couldn't do pickup. You had to do an in-store purchase to apply those coupons. Very tricky of you, Target. But I said to myself, Ray? Do it for the dollars. Just go. Fun fact about me, I actually live 30 minutes out of our nearest town, so it is quite an adventure when I do need to go to town, especially with a baby. We made it. Brinley is still sleeping, so that's a good sign. And here is me praying that she stays asleep while I shop. I love saving my Starbucks points to get me free coffee when I am out on a shopping trip.
I also got 70 cents off each gallon of gas today because I used my grocery store rewards points. Overall, I'd say this was a really good day of saving. Now, of course, I headed over to my Fetch Rewards app to take a picture of my receipt. I know a lot of couponers are fans of Ibotta. For me, uh, that app just has me spending more money because you need to actually select things before going to the store. With Fetch Rewards, you're just taking a picture of every single receipt and you get points for every receipt. Sometimes you'll get extra points for things that you bought, but I even scan my Taco Bell, you know, McDonald's, every store, you get points for it. So if you don't already have Fetch Rewards, you can download the app and use this code and you'll get 2,000 extra points when you sign up. If you are thinking about building either a food, diaper, supply, stockpile, and starting to prep so that you're prepared for emergency situations like me, please consider subscribing. I just started prepping a few months ago and I've started this journey of self-sufficiency. My channel is all about learning to be less reliant on the stores and having things on hand for yourself as well as learning new skills that could help you in a situation where you needed to provide for your kids. If you have any advice for me, if there's a video you'd like to see, something you're interested in learning more about, please leave a comment down below. I upload new videos every Sunday night. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up so that I can reach other parents who might also find this information useful. I really appreciate it.